Good evening. I would like for you all to imagine a seed in a pot of soil in a windowsill. Now, I would like you, for you to imagine this seed to be watered for the very first time. As the night progresses, this seed will sprout roots, and these roots lead to a plant. As this plant is watered daily, it, it thrives off this water in hopes to bear fruit in the near future. However, this plant goes through a drought, and without water, this plant will surely die. In this particular life cycle, the seed represents every student who requires federal aid in the form of student loans, and the water represents the money from these student loans. Each student in the situation pays for college via student loans, and the money from these student loans allows them to, to have hope and dreams and aspirations. But however, the once this money stops coming in, uh, after the grace periods and they go through a drought and they must now pay this money um, back. And, and this is a prevalent issue because the growing standard after high school is now college and the average student graduates with an average of $26,000 in debt. According to Forbes, as of 2013, this every, the student debt exceeded $1.2 trillion. And this is important to note because the past three years, student uh, tuition rates and prices have risen. So that means that this number has risen substantially. What this all means is that this is leading to a cycle of financial instability for many young adults in our nation. And what this does is it cripples an individual's ability to make financial decisions. And once an individual cannot make financial decisions, this leads to families instability to make financial, financial decisions. Once this is, is known and they have children, it is much more prevalent that these children will be financially unstable. And this is important to know because that the harsh reality is today that everything in our society costs money. Society costs money. And everyone knows that the old cliche, the children are our future. But I say that this cannot be embraced by our societies today because our educational systems are set up for so many of our young adults to fail. This is why I have decided to create Youthful Lands. It is a youth-led landscaping company devoted to the employment of young adults in, before, and after college. In this work, Youthful Lands hopes to employ kids in their communities to work in home and lawn projects that they can be proud of in years to come, and it will instill self-worth in them. Um, and through this work and the hours generated, scholarship opportunities can be applied and be given to these kids so that, so that options like student loans can be avoided and, and financial instability can be avoided altogether. Youthful Lands Landscaping Company is devoted to the investment of the youth to provide a more sustainable future. It is a mentorship for college and high school students, and it employs principles such as quality work it, to employ youth, uh, young adults while providing quality assistance in home and lawn projects, as well as environmental and health education, promoting healthy diet and lifestyle, as well as ex exercise and outdoor time spent and Youthful Lands also recognizes the current environmental crisis that we are now in and that a collective effort must now be taken nationally and globally for change to be taken. Um, and Youthful Lands also urges the action, education, use, and imp implementation of clean energy as well as activism in the realm of environmental preservation. Youthful Lands is centered around the aspect of community outreach. And what community outreach means is to keep kids in areas that m are more underprivileged and poverty stricken, um, keep them off the streets and away from negative influences like drugs and crime. <coughs> and through this work, Youth Alliance hopes to um, implement the involvement of the youth in the communities so that they can develop the youth into well well-informed and productive members of their societies. 
Through all this work and, and time spent with these kids, we hope to bring back the sense of community and interrelationships inter within this community that has been lost through, through decades of greed brought by big companies and, and many different things such as that. And Youth Philan's main goal is to assist the underprivileged and stresses the import, importance of our youth as well as the preservation of our earth because we recognize that without the health of our earth, there will be no future to invest into. Youthful Lands as a whole hopes to water the seed of every individual member, allowing for constant flows of water to create plants that are capable to bear fruits that are, that are debt free. Throughout this hard work and dedication, Youthful Lands hopes to turn cycles of financial instability into cycles of financial freedom. Thank you.